the tutors and the staff here at BSA are sort of incredible. Um, you know, Stephen Sims worked, the head of the school worked for more than a decade at the RSC, um, which is sort of enough to me to come. <laughs> I mean, if that the guy is the head of your school, he's he really knows what he's talking about. Um, Alex Taylor and Simon Ratcliffe and Francois Wallo and David Jackson, I mean, these people, they know everything about the business in this country. The thing that I knew I needed to change about myself as an actor was to become more physical, to become more aware of my body, and this program has provided the most amazing opportunities for me to do that. And especially the sense of ensemble and being affected by another person. Uh, I think um, acting is generally about affecting other people, and that is something that this school and the philosophy here never misses. I think one of the other key elements within the tradition of the development of acting in Britain is about the relationship between the actor and the audience. So it's traditional to focus on the relationship between the actor and the other actors, and we would still emphasize that. We think collaboration and ensemble is absolutely central, and that is something I think that we're working with and towards all the time. So there's just a few little refinements we can do in terms of staging. Um, and also in terms of, you know, and, and also make sure that that kind of aggressive intention, intention is actually maintained throughout the fight, that's important too. I think that American students should choose to attend BSA because it is a unique MFA program and an experience that you will not find anywhere else. I came here because I wanted to study in England and that has been one of my dreams for my entire life. And this is one of two programs in this entire country that awards an MFA and not an MA. So you can have the experience of studying British drama in England and then go back and be qualified to teach at university level. And also we're a train ride away from Stratford-upon-Avon and we get free tickets to go see shows at the RSC. We've had voice workshops with some of the leading voice professionals in the world and I would never have had that experience in the U.S., no matter where I went. <laughs>